Saint Louis is a historic city, a World uh, Heritage uh, Site according to UNESCO. And it's located in the northern part of Senegal on a shallow sand strip between the sea and the river. So there's a very strong flood risk uh, from both the river and from the seaside. There's a very widespread coastal erosion. In 2003, during high water from the river, they dug a trench to divert the river water. This has created a new river mouth that has migrated and grew. Cette nouvelle embouchure du fleuve dérive vers le sud avec une vitesse moyenne de l'ordre de 500 mètres par an. Et cela a généré de nombreux impacts pour les enjeux et usages présents sur l'ensemble du bas delta du fleuve Sénégal. The saltwater intrusion into the system decreased potential for agriculture in the area. Also a lot of freshwater fish disappeared, which forced the fishermen to go out to sea and they had to pass through this new river mouth which was very unstable and, and dangerous, so a lot of fishermen lost their lives. So there are really multiple negative impacts of this dynamic environment. Tout cela, nous avons démarré depuis deux ans des études avec euh, le groupement Aegis de Tares de trouver des solutions adéquates. The objective of our studies is really to support the local government in determining sustainable strategies for the area. The project approach is to really study historic data and also measurement campaigns to learn about the, the system behavior that provides uh, data for model validation. The models are increasingly capable of predicting what will happen to the coast or to a certain uh, intervention on a time scale of years to decades. And the more data you can put into it, uh, the better they get, but also without all that data, they explain the processes that play a role there. So we have a very strong technical component, which we combine with more the socio-economic studies. And in this cadre, our objective is to propose several scenarios d'aménagement à un comité de pilotage de l'étude où seront présents l'ensemble des décideurs sénégalais qui choisiront en fait la meilleure des solutions à adopter sur la zone d'étude. In all our projects, we also integrate a strong consultation with the stakeholders because as Deltares, we also want to create impact for the communities themselves. Teamwork is a very important aspect to these challenging projects. We work together with two partners. ACs bring in their expertise on river dynamics. And very importantly, they have a local office. And IHE organizes the local trainings, a very important aspect of this study. We started with general coastal morphology processes and how to measure them and how to simulate them with relatively standard exercises. Then we went a bit further into the actual the models that we developed for San Luis. And in the last one, we also trained them in the use of this shorelines model. The project in Senegal shows the need to understand the full complexity, to engage with the different actors, to come with uh, integrated and uh, long-term solutions. When we understand better, we can act better in a more efficient way to face face to all these aléas. Toutes ces prédictions, tous ces outils nous permettent véritablement de bien anticiper les problèmes et ça c'est vraiment une grande avancée pour nous. Nous le souhaitons ardemment, de tout cœur et nous espérons que dans dix ans il fera mieux vivre et que Saint-Louis euh, redeviendra ce qu'elle a été dans le passé et encore mieux. As Deltares, we have experience in Africa, but we believe that we can do more to uh, create impact together with our clients and partners. So we really encourage potential uh, partners at the local level or internationally to reach out to Deltares to discuss together of the challenges in the region and to think together on sustainable and inclusive solutions that can ensure a brighter future in West Africa.